What's up, guys? I'm going to try to make this very quick. About three or four, maybe five minutes long. Okay, guys. This is the Hobby Plus Trail Hunter Evil. Okay? I heard the horror story that when you take the body off, that you ha you'll have a problem with the shift linkage or whatever coming undone. Then you have a, it's kind of hard to get back on when you put the body back on. Okay, well, I just figured out how to uh, leave you, get, get rid of that problem. Okay? It's quite simple. And here's all that I did. Let me see if I can turn my light on. Um, oh, well, the light's not coming on. But anyway, I can show you guys. What I decided to do, ladies and gentlemen, is you see these little boxes on the side here? Little uh, gas can or whatever, storage boxes, whatever they got on the side of the, on the, of the trail hunter. What I did was I got some double-sided tape and I put it on the bottom of the servo and I stuck the servo inside the box. Yeah, with double-sided tape. That's it. You can see right there. And it works flawlessly. I've got one hand. Let me see if I can make a video of driving it. Hang on. Watch this. Hang on. I don't want to chew up my wires here. Because it will do it. <laughs> okay, hang on. Here we go. All right, there you go. I'm going to shift it. There you go. Crawler speed. High speed. Crawler speed. High speed. Crawler speed. High speed. So it works flawlessly. High speed right there. Crawler speed. There it is. Uh-huh. Yep. Now, again, guys, very simple. That servo simply mounted inside the box. I don't know why Hobby Plus didn't do that in the first place. Uh, I think it's a shame that they didn't do that in the first place. But now you got a clean setup. You can see from the top right there. Because I'm not the smartest kid on the block. But I spent almost two hours, guys. I had taken the car apart. The truck apart. I put in a 180 turn motor. As I said in the other video, if you want to go from the 130 to the 180, and if you use the Traxxas motors with the Traxxas, uh, you know, motor pinions or whatever, it's the same pitch. So the gear mesh is perfect. As you just saw, that is a Traxxas TRX4 motor, and it works fine in this little Hobby Plus uh, uh, Trail Hunter Evo. Same pitch for the gears. And the other uh, video I made I kept on saying mesh I meant the same I meant to say same gear pitch so that way guys you got your servo mounted inside the box you know you don't have to worry you can see that it's shifting flawlessly yeah guys that's all it took because I, I got really frustrated because I had already spent like two hours trying to figure out how to get that little wire because it was you know the servos originally attached to the roll cage and I was having problems trying to get that thing in the hole driving me crazy so I, I said, you know what? Let me figure this out another way. And I came up with that mount right there. So I'm sure this will help some of you guys. Some of you guys have already probably figured out how to do this. I don't know. But that's what I came up with. It works great. I'm very happy that I did it. Later.